السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته حياكم الله ومعكم محمد البسيمي ومعاي مدير مجتمع بيس العالمي آدم باتي هاي آدم هاي هاو يو I'm fine how are you I'm fine thank you and uh, finally we'll be playing uh, PES very soon yes. uh, the full version and uh, the release is uh, is near and uh, we're excited for the all the new content in the game especially yes. you know for our region yes there are a lot uh, of things coming yes definitely yeah obviously the um, AFC Champions League is a, is a, is a big inclusion this year shows our commitment to the to the region to the area and finally you know rewarding those fans who have been supporting us for so long nice so we're in the main menu right now and for the exhibition match that's correct yeah that's right i mean people can see here the manchester united logo on the top left and run robin van persie there nice. um the, this is something that you can choose in the game when you first get the game it is it sort of asks you it's like your favorite team your favorite team and okay. then you can pick a player as well nice. uh, and you can change that whenever you want so you're not nice. stuck to one player or team okay so this is a, a quick look at the menu we won't stay for too long it's a little bit of an exclusive look for for the fans here okay nice. um but just to stick to rules we're yeah. gonna uh, play as bay munich against manchester united okay, i'll be okay. uh, the european champions and we'll go straight into kickoff. So, how many teams will have this uh, stadium look? You know, the fans and the interactions. Mm. All the licensed stadiums in the game will have these, you know, these fans, choreography, uh, tofu uh, style to the intro for the home teams. For the home teams, yeah. Um, okay. I mean, I mean, it's well, it's for, it's for the stadium as well. So, obviously, if you're a if you're a team which isn't in the game or isn't licensed you can assign them to an unlicensed stadium and then have that uh, oh, okay. have that intro going for them if you know what i mean very very different but the 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 real life world accurate ones are all for the teams with their home stadium in the game nice. so here you can see a nice so, so alex ferguson just came up there yeah. really really close when you see that in daytime as well you'll get a different effect nice. as well and one thing you'll notice as well when the when their players are coming out um, it's from the corner there. You can see the little tube coming out. Yeah, it's um, so special for this stadium. That's right. Yeah. yeah. So we've we've gone back to basics with the stadium accuracy, and we've made sure that things like where players come out of the actual tunnel is super accurate. Yeah. It's part of the key, one of the key features, which is called the so, the core, go, which is the visual s style of it. Yeah, and the likeness of the players. You know, this year you have the Fox engine, mm. and you've been posting pictures on yeah. your Twitter account. I think <laughs> causing I, some problems. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, causing a lot of excitement because yeah. yeah. you know people can finally see what the Fox engine can do. And let's you know, let's be honest, this is a real first look for everybody. Just. Yeah even outside of football game fans who want to see what the Fox engine can do. Yeah. And it's like a, you know, it's, it's, it's a first opportunity for people to actually see that, never mind if they play yeah. football games or not. And uh, these pictures have been posted. People have been, you know, impressed by what uh, the mm. players look like. Mm. 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 I mean, it, it's actually a testament to the team because yeah. one thing that happens is with this new engine, you have to rebuild everything. Yeah. So you start from scratch. It's not a case of taking PES 2013 faces or pictures and mapping them over a model you have to rebuild them yeah. so the work is you know as you can see dante here looking absolutely perfect but it takes a lot of time and effort as well yeah so here hopefully i'll show you a really good victory okay uh, <laughs> and not get beat at least so you can see is it, um, the hardest the difficulty for the um people? sure <laughs> i think it's actually um medium regular so oh, okay, it's, it's okay. like a preset one so okay. Um, that's one guaranteed way of me winning. Nice. Uh, but at least the fans will see a lot more action. I recorded a video f for the websites and stuff, and it was a little bit boring. Yeah, so yeah. hopefully, it'll get more action <laughs> for you guys. I, uh, you know, one of the things that you can notice uh, when you start the game is that the animation is looking much better than last year. Yeah, it's it's a, it's a huge plus for us, and that's that's with the new animation system. It's uh, something be behind the new feature called Mass, which yeah, is motion. Forward animation stability system yeah and what that gives us is a brand new look to the game and um, it's full proof that we have rebuilt the game it's not just a, a rehash of a, of the old game and you can see players here yeah. reacting differently how they pass and move 
And you know, one of the hardest things to get right in the game is, uh, is the physics, you know, when two players yeah. collide or they just, uh, you know, uh, mm. run uh, next to each other. Uh, sometimes you get, you know, undesirable yeah. results. Yeah, definitely. And it's something that, that, that we've been, you know, accused of not doing right in the past. Yeah. So we've we actually focused on, at least, you know, with the new engine, we actually wanted to make sure that we would at least deliver something really impressive and obviously with the Fox engine it's allowed us to do that. Nice. And uh, you know last year uh, people saw uh, PES 2013, mm. it was a great improvement. It's like uh, one of, I think it's the biggest step for PES in recent years, you know, mm. especially this generation. Yeah. So people got, you know, uh, they got hyped and uh, they are very excited for this year. Uh, many people think that this year it will be the return of PES, you know. To the top of the game we well that's our target yeah. for sure that's a nice save there yeah. i mean we 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 wanted to to bring out this game with this new engine on the current console to actually re re reward the fans because one thing that we didn't want to do is so this is a new way of doing the corner right? oh yeah yeah we'll talk about this very quickly so you got this icon you can press the rb or the r1 button to just to uh, take it off if you oh, want a okay. bit more skill or if you think it's going to be a little but bit too easy that one will help you out yeah you know, where the ball is going exactly and then you can see the 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 dotted line is a little bit yellow that's based on the on the new heart system yeah the heart system. which is the motivation system so you can actually see how a player is performing just by seeing how his free kick yeah. line is or you know the what color, sort of color yeah. oh it's totally got free schweinsteiger that's the goal. But yeah, the heart system is all based on the player motivation. It's something brand new in PES. So, for example, now uh, this player yes. will be motivated. Exactly. Right? Yeah, yeah. It would have been good to see how his motivation was before the goal, just to, yeah. to, to, to show the impact. But for example, if he's motivated now, yeah. I can expect more from him. Like his skills will improve or something like that. Well, it's yeah, it's it's their um, overall stats regarding their improvement. So back in the back in the old PES, I'm just going to show this actually yeah. now to the fans. You, you you have the form arrow, and the form arrow would be a percentage of, you know, if it was purple, for example, you can see Cruz there in the middle, he would be minus, say, yeah. f say five five points on shooting or dribbling with, with a purple arrow. Nice. And so what the heart feature does, it actually balances that. So there you can see Schweinsteiger has a really high form arrow, but now he's got a bit of heart and emotion there as well. Ribery's already oh, up okay. for the game and Mandzukic and stuff like that. Rooney. Johnny Evans. So, so that's how we've tried to bring in something really unique in the single player experience as well. So when you play Master League, you'll go from team to team, and no matter how small they are or big they are, you know, you'll you'll feel like if you're going to a supposedly smaller team, they're they're, they're really fighting you and giving you a lot of problems. Oh, okay, nice. Rooney on the ball. And also, uh, one of the most important things in, in PES that also we would love to see some improvements on is the AI. Yeah, definitely. And, you know, we have brought in things like combination play and uh, strategy integrator, which allows people to, to do a lot of things with, the, with your team as well. So we have some presets for, for, for the way how certain teams play. So like a, a Napoli is a full-on counter-attacking team, for example, and you've got a Barcelona with a possession play. You'll notice things like this. Say if you have a goal kick and you're against Barcelona, their forwards will mark your left back and right back. Okay. Just like in real life, how they push up high. Yeah. Things like that you can set up in your team. Nice. So yeah, there's a lot of improvements to the AI and also to the you know to the the way each team actually differentiates as well. So it's a you know a new experience every time. The personality of the game. Of yeah. The exactly. I mean, it's something that we're still improving as well. A lot of the things that we faced with this new engine, a lot of challenges, and you know making it work and making sure our our sort of ideology of bringing simulation football is there and we and we've worked really hard on on the pitch that's yeah. been the, the the focus for us to make sure that, that the gameplay is king and so far you know people who have played it really uh, think that it is and also uh, one of the things that you've been working hard on is like uh, is bringing new teams new licenses to the game this yeah year, this year uh, you announced uh, the argentinian uh, league hmm. Uh, so th that's fully licensed, all the team, all the, all the players, right? Absolutely, yeah. Um, 
I mean, yeah, I mean, it's the same with the Chilean league as well. Obviously, the the um, AFC. Um, we've got the Libertadores back, as you saw. Yeah, um, last year, that's what, yeah. Yeah, um, and we've got, obviously got, you know, the Brazilian league again as well. So what we've been doing really is is going after key key markets where where like you know people are, are in love with pairs yeah. and, and they really support us it's sort of going back to our fans and saying thank you and i think that's one of the reasons why i think the middle eastern uh, fans are, have been supporting us for many years they're very passionate yeah exactly and it's so, about time that we did reward them i think so this is a thank you for them to bring uh, definitely the definitely for sure but also yeah. i think in general the 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 license is is, is a is a big one and you know Pez is is not just a European brand or an Asian brand it's international and you know that's something that we've always had in our heritage um, so we need to start proving that to the people by you know showing them that we do care about um, everybody not just a certain territory and I think you know the, the, the European fans have to be happy. We've got a lot of European leagues in there as well, so it's yeah, about yeah, time that we did. Yeah, and everyone watches and European football. Yeah. Right? And it's, uh, it's something that everyone enjoys even outside of Europe. Mm. But it's, it's, it's um, uh, the special thing is to have, you know, a local team, the team that you support locally here. Mm. Uh, for example, in Saudi Arabia, to, you know, to play with your team in the, in, in the football game that you loved all the time, you know, it's something real special. Mm. Definitely. And also there is the customization, you know, if someone wanted some player or something, you know, to change the team, uh, names, it's always been something associated with uh, PES. Uh, the power to customize everything. Yeah, and we've added uh, two extra fake leagues as well in the game where yeah. you can customize as well how many teams are in that league as well. So you've got two extra Division 1 leagues where people could make. And, you know, we've got a really big uh, community which loves to create option files and, um, you yeah. know, make the game as authentic as possible. And what we've done is we've, we've, we've given them even, you know, more opportunity to, you know, to add more leagues. Mm. And also, you have more stadiums this year. We have, we haven't actually uh, spoken much about the stadiums yet, which we will have after. Um, but regarding the actual number of stadiums, we're still trying to confirm exactly. The main reason is is is, is because again, as with all the art, we have to rebuild everything from scratch. Yeah, of course. Thank you, Adam. This was a wonderful look at this. Thank you so much. 2014, and we're looking forward to it. Great. Um, Thank you very much again, and I hope to see you again in another event also, and maybe more of this. <laughs> Definitely. Thank you so much for having me. Thank you very much. Javi Martinez. Tony Cruz, who has an assist to his name. There goes the whistle, and it's half-time. Two goals on the score sheet.